Hi guys, Ash here. This year, you know, the most talked about phone has been the Galaxy S3. So, uh, there are some special features for the Galaxy S3 like Smart Stay, the Burst Mode, uh, the pop-up player and so on. So today, I'm just gonna go ahead and show you how to get these on other devices, these three features, uh, using apps from the Play Store. There is this app called Smart Stay X or EX. Uh, it's in the light version is available for free and this is compatible on a limited amount of devices. So the link to this app is in the description. So go through this, uh, go through that link and uh, in the Play Store you will find the compatibility list. So check if your device is on it or if your device uh, is listed as not working. So how this works is, uh, alright let me just you know, you just need to turn it on. All right. Uh, once you've turned it on, it'll ask you to turn off the screen and turn it on once, and turn it on. And now Smart Stay is on. You will see the uh, icon over there. So now if, I'm just going to go into Settings, Display, and I'm going to change my timeout to 15 seconds. All right. Now I'm going to open the browser and uh, go on to YouTube so alright guys so I'm just gonna go ahead uh, and hit the timer over here so we're gonna start the timer and there you can see that the screen turned off now resetting the timer and I'm gonna look at the phone right now Make sure I'm on the camera, front camera. Start the timer. As you can see, the screen does not turn off. And now I'm gonna put the put it back. And as you see, the screen turns off in 15 seconds. So that's smart stay. So guys, one more thing that is really talked about is the burst mode of the One X and the S3, and uh, it is possible even on devices like the, like the Galaxy Note uh, with this app called Fast Burst Camera. So guys, the number of shots you take per second, you know, depends on the power of your phone. So with the Note and so on, you can take quite a few shots. Uh, so let me just show you that. So here we are. I'm just going to do a sweep from here to there. Alright, and once it's done, it will take a little while to actually save the photos. So, in the meantime, you can check out a few photos. Uh, for all the photos of the burst mode to be uh, saved, it just it takes a while. So, going in. You've taken more than 70 photos. Okay, that's done. So, so yeah, you get the idea. So guys, uh, while you do not take your 8 megapixel photos with this uh, for the Galaxy Note, you can take, uh, let me just show you the, going to more and preferences, the photo resolution is lower than your camera's ability, but uh, at least you get burst mode, so just letting you guys know that. You've got other options here, single click shooting, delay between shots, uh, and so on. You can set the delay over here between shots. And you can also select the storage location and advanced features. The last app uh, that I'm going to talk about here today uh, is something that, uh, what do you say, Ga Galaxy Note owners may, might not really care a lot about because the pop-up player uh, has come to the Galaxy Note with 4.0.4 .4 update by default. Um, this app is called Super Video Player. So this gives the pop-up play functionality 
to all devices. And the different, and even with the pop-up player, guys, uh, even you know with the default pop-up player, there's not much you can do uh, once the player is up. Uh, so, oh, with the super video player, you can actually choose the size uh, size of the player over there, and you can forward by you know dragging and holding over here the lower bottom, and you can adjust the volume with the right side. And you can also go back full screen and uh, pop out again. So that's pretty much it guys uh, when it comes to replicating some of uh, the Galaxy S3's popular features onto other Android devices. Uh, once again, uh, for each app just check the compatibility lists on uh, the Play Store. Uh, because I'm not exactly sure on you know which devices might not be compatible. There are lots of devices out there, so I wouldn't be able to help you out, you know, with specific devices. So uh, if you have any suggestions or comments, leave it in the comment section, or you guys can hit me up on Facebook, Twitter, or email me directly. All my contact details are in the description. Uh, that's pretty much it, guys. Before you go, make sure you hit the like and subscribe buttons. Uh, the subscribe button especially. Because uh, I will be coming out of more videos uh, for Android in general, the Galaxy Note, the S3, the One X, uh, Nexus 7, whatever device that I can get my hand on. So, and if you guys do want to help me out, choose my links to Amazon in the description. Uh, uh, just go through to Amazon. If there's anything you want to purchase online, just go through to Amazon using my links, and I tend to make a few cents to a few bucks on every order you place. So, uh, that's if you guys do want to help me out, which I hope you do. So. That's pretty much it guys. Thanks a lot for watching and I'll see you guys soon. Till then, bye bye now.